these properties had been for sale for many years prior to J. Jefferson Company acquiring them in 2019. And we're a Milwaukee-based firm. The Milwaukee Journal Sentinel buildings are right in our backyard. This is where the news for the entire metropolitan area was written, manufactured. It kind of just got us thinking about how to rejuvenate this block of buildings in a way where it would again play that mission critical role as an ecosystem for the Milwaukee community. Milwaukee Area Technical College, or MATC, is a, a very vibrant and very critical college in the downtown Milwaukee area. We were aware that MATC had been looking for student housing. The adjacent Milwaukee Journal building was a great candidate for conversion to market rate multifamily housing. And then we were approached by the Seeds of Health Tenor High School. They were interested in the Milwaukee Sentinel buildings, which are directly behind the original Milwaukee Journal building. It, it allows for this continuum of education and workforce development for the block. There are instances so far of Seeds of Health high school students becoming MATC college students and living in that student housing next door to where they went to high school. And then MATC students who have graduated and then moved next door to the Journal Commons building to continue to be able to live downtown. One of the biggest challenges was that the floor plate was just so gigantic. So the suggestion to us to core a light well into the center of the building it can strike us on the surface as something that the Park Service would get behind. But we actually were able to find a pretty logical way that was sensitive to original design intent, architectural integrity. When people think of historic preservation, they think of buildings from the 19th century. One of the things we were able to do is to show the market, just because a building was built somewhat more recently, there still is potential for reimagining and reusing these buildings. All the same reasons that you'd want to preserve a building from the 1800s also applied to a building from the 1950s, 60s, 70s. We were able to recreate that and hope that this can inspire others in the challenging and really fun creative effort of reimagining old buildings.